Mules basketball searching for a third straight win hosting Emporia State. Central Missouri comes in 2-5 and five in MIAA play, 7-6 and six overall. Less than five minutes until the break, Caleb Nero puts up a floater, ties it at 18. But the Mules would trail it 24-23 at halftime. Four minutes into the second half, Mules down by three. Tim Jordan Jr. underneath kicks it out to Jalen Knott in the corner, knocks down the triple, that ties it at 31. Knott led the Mules with a game-high 19 points plus five rebounds. A few minutes later, off the miss, Jordan Hayes flies in for the putback. The Mules take the lead 35 to 34. Hayes had 10 points and 10 rebounds. Then Knott feeds Jordan in the paint, lays it in. Jordan had 10 points and four boards. Midway through the half, Keith Kiner, the third, just pulls up and connects for three. UCM on top, 42 to 39. Under seven minutes to go, Mules trailing by two. Knott in the right corner, gets the triple to fall. A little later, Knott with another three ball from the opposite corner. Then Kiner with the rebound and puts up a two-handed jam, part of a 10-0 run for Central Missouri. Kiner had 13 points, nine rebounds, and four assists. The Mules hold on to beat Emporia State 60-53. Central Missouri improves to 3-5 at the MIAA, 8-6 and six overall. Was really encouraged by how we kind of stayed the course. Um, pretty dismal offensively in the first half. and. Um, but, but stayed with it and, and stayed with the things that we had talked about. And, you know, we said at halftime we hadn't, you know, gotten in the paint very much and we hadn't shot enough triples and we hadn't got to the line at all. And in the second half, I thought there was a real concentrated effort to do those things. And uh, we passed the ball to each other much better in the second half. And, and so the offense was a lot better and um, a really good effort. Our last home game uh, down the stretch, we had a couple up and down moments, you know, a couple of turnovers, a couple of defensive lapses. but. Um, past couple of practices we've been working on the day in day out. We probably worked on it for an extra 20, 30 minutes, you know? So I mean, showing that it's paying off and we improving on it, I mean, it just shows that practice really matters.